Welcome, welcome everyone to our, our grand opening of our, our new uh, civil process office here. Uh, and thank you to uh, the city and Mayor Koch for uh, allowing us to move into his building. <laughs> um, but I want, before I introduce the uh, president of the uh, Chamber of Commerce, I want to introduce some of the uh, dignitaries that are here. Of course, uh, Mayor Koch, he's here. Uh, District Attorney Mike Morrissey. Nice County day. Commissioner Joe Shea. Nicely done. Nicely done. County Treasurer Michael Bellotti, former sheriff. Is. State Rep Tacky Chan. Back man. Uh, Ward 1 Councilor Dave McCarthy. Good. Uh, Weymouth at Large, Councilor Fred Happel. Ready. Uh, from Senator Mike Rush's office, Ann Cushing. Ann is over here. And from Senator Brady's office, Jimmy Valentin. To me. So thank yes, you all for coming. Good. I'm going to hand it off to uh, the president of the Quincy Chamber of Commerce, Tim Cahill. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Chris. I appreciate it. I'm going to hand it off to the mayor real quick. I just want to welcome you all to beautiful downtown Quincy. Welcome to the Sheriff's Office here. Uh, you're going to love it. I know you weren't that far away, but this is, uh, this is the gem of the Dr. Morrissey? <laughs> <laughs> and um, we're really oh, thrilled to have the Sheriff, who not only runs a great Sheriff's Office in Wilford County, um, but is a very, very important and, and generous supporter of the Quincy Chamber of Commerce. So we appreciate it as the city supports us as does the county, it, it means a lot to us. So we thank you and we welcome you here. And without further ado, I'm gonna introduce um, our mayor, who is, uh, I think, officially running for another term. So that's really Excellent. good. Excellent. We're really excited about that. Not everyone's happy about that. <laughs> we are, we are. We are in the chamber. But she's not here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, Mayor, mayor Tom Coke. Mr. Mayor. That was just a test to see our response time. I think we're doing all right. Uh, when uh, the sheriff, uh, we talked about the space some time ago, uh, thought it made some sense. As, uh, as some of you know, we purchased the building with some federal money a couple of years back, and we have some long-term plans. I didn't think it'd have it done before we took the building to rip it down, but, uh, but we got there. Um, it, it's certainly a pleasure to work with the sheriff. We, we go back a few years. Uh, sure when I was with Jim Sheets and Pat was serving the good people of Ward 3 uh, in his capacity. So we've, we've crossed paths over the years on a number of issues. Uh, this was kind of a cool one to work with them on. Uh, it's good for the public, it's good for the county, it's certainly good for the sheriff. It's good for the square. It gives us additional presence of uh, good positive people around. I mean, we've had a lot of changes in the square, but uh, we still have some challenges from time to time. So I think the presence of this office here will also be a benefit uh, to the downtown. So just happy to be here and congratulate the sheriff. Well, thank you, Mr. Mayor. Um, so I just, I wanna welcome everybody here today. This is, uh, this has been kind of a, a dream for the last year to get this together. You know, we, for those of you that don't know, we've uh, moved a little bit, just a little bit down the street. We were located over on the parking way uh, in a much larger space, but the space was getting a little tired. Uh, it was getting expensive. So we were looking for a different place to go. We certainly didn't want to leave the city of Quincy. So I was blessed to be able to get in touch with the mayor and, and work this, uh, this, uh, this opportunity for us. Cuts our costs almost in half and uh, puts us in a better location. But, you know, just to walk down quickly on memory lane, you know, it's great to see Joe Shea and the DA, Mike and the treasurer here. Uh, but 25 years ago, uh, I had the very good, distinct pleasure of serving as the chair um, of the City Council's Downtown and Economic Development Committee. You know, I served with Councilor Good, well, President Cahill, then Councilor Cahill, and I, and I know Tim was very actively involved with the downtown redevelopment. And, you know, we put plans together and we, we had a vision of what to do. And uh, unfortunately, we didn't have the resources or sometimes just not the strength to get things done. But I'll tell you something, how many, more, how many years have you been in Mayor? 16. 16 years. It was about 16 years ago, there was somebody that came into office that took the vision of what we had for the downtown and actually put it into fruition, put it in the making. And that's why we have a gorgeous Hancock Adams Green right next door here to the sheriff's office. That's why we have uh, residents moving into the downtown, Be great restaurants. I know that we'll be frequenting Gunther Tootie's next door quite a bit, uh, but at the end of the day, this is a collaborative uh, process, uh, along with the city of Quincy, the people in Norfolk County, who are obviously funding this venture. 
Uh, I want to thank a lot of people. I could go on and on, but I know we have some good stuff going on inside. But I certainly want to thank the staff. You know, this project was not without its hiccups, and we were able to overcome a lot of challenges, not just with the building. The building was the least of our challenges, but we were able to overcome those things. We put together a great team of people, great team of professionals to put this project together. Uh, our outside contractors were absolutely great. Our inside help was fantastic. And I would be remiss if I didn't highlight the great work that's being done by our civil process team. So I want to give a round of applause to our civil, civil process team. Anita, all of our serving deputies uh, that make, make the civil process division of the Norfolk County Sheriff's Office as efficient as it is. And we're looking to expand that. That's why we've partnered up with our local bar association here in Norfolk County, the Mass Bar Association. What we do in the civil process office is help citizens serve legal process, work towards doing asset forfeiture, forfeiture and other issues that are very important for the legal process uh, of moving forward uh, on people's issues. So I thank the staff. I thank the residents of the city of Quincy, the taxpayers of Norfolk County, certainly the mayor, the Chamber of Commerce, and all of you here today that have come here to celebrate what is a monumental uh, ribbon cutting opportunity. Everybody's gonna be able to enjoy themselves after the ribbon cutting, and then to the staff, back to work on Monday, okay? <laughs> so congratulations to everybody, thank you. And now, without further ado. Ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Nicely done. You're professional at this. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you, Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.